So we use our smartphone for a lot of things and one of them is clicking photos in our everyday life. And that is why in this video, I'm going to be telling you five photo editing apps for your Android device that you should definitely use in the year 2024. So without wasting any time, let's hit the intro. First one in the list is Adobe Lightroom, which is the best professional photo editing app for Android. As this app offers a one-stop solution for all of your editing requirements. And with the inclusion of AI features as well, Adobe Lightroom is the perfect photo editing app for refining your photos and even your videos. You can crop portraits, adjust the color palette and light, retouch and remove objects and can even change backgrounds as well. And Lightroom consists of many inbuilt presets and filters, which will save you lots of time while editing your photos. So on the second number, we have Google Photos, which is Android's go-to photo editing app. As it comes as a pre-installed app on your phone and it is super handy. It has got a clean interface and lots of intuitive tools, including AI effects as well. And that's why it's one of the best photo editing app for your Android device, that too without a watermark. Now this app is only for the people who are very simplistic and don't want to do much when it comes to editing their photos. As it has got easy sliders for color or light adjustments and you can also sort all of your photos into an album with the help of AI as well. One of the benefit of using Google Photos is that it backs up all of your photos into the cloud and you can search any of your photos directly from Google Lens. And that is why it plugs into the Google ecosystem very well. But as I said, it might not be able to satisfy all of the people who want advanced photo editing. And that is why I've got you in the third number, Snapseed app. Snapseed is one of the best free photo editing app out there in the market and it suits advanced photo editors as well. This app has got a clean and simple interface by which you can make the adjustments with a swift swipe or scroll. And it has got all of the advanced tools for photo editing, be it adjusting color, light, saturation, masking or even reshaping. But if you want to go further, you can even blend two photos, work on 3D models or go vintage, grainy or dramatic with Snapseed's ecosystem. And Snapseed is a completely free app that you can use and that is the reason why most of the professionals love this app. So on the fourth number in the list, we have the Canva app. Now Canva app is for all those people who want to do versatile things right from their app. Whether it is editing photos, videos, social media posts, gift cards and so on as it has got fun filters, stickers, animations, and music overlay support. And that is why Canva is a perfect app for those who just don't want to edit photos, but also venture into the video sphere as well. And notice that this app has got thousands of templates, mockups, and assets of 2 million plus, and a stock library with more than a million of assets. So if your turnaround time is very less, then Canva can be a game changer app for you in terms of photo editing. Now last but not the least, on the fifth number, we have got the Prisma app. Now, unlike other apps, this app won't give you much of the editing tools, but it can turn your photos into a great artwork. As after using this app, it can transform your images into a stunning masterpiece of Picasso or Van Gogh. You can change the background, beautify your skin or facial features, or even give an artistic retouch to your original clicks with the help of Prisma app. And this app has also got 500 plus unique filters and effects that will make your photos pop out even more creatively. And hence, you can get the creative juices flowing. So all of the five apps that I've told are free apps. That means you don't have to pay anything to use them. However, there are premium features as well for all of these apps and for that you do have to pay. But having said that, you guys do let me know in the comment section that which is your favorite photo editing app and which of the app you are using currently. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Till then, don't forget to subscribe to Geekify.